I want to be. Oh please, 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 oh please. Friends forever with you. Ah! <laughs> so close. <laughs> What's up, my beardos and weirdos? One topic here. And today we're diving back into r slash Sappho and her friend. I'm actually really excited to go back into the subreddit again. It was asked for a lot after the last one we did, and I had so much fun with that one that I'm really looking forward to this one. <laughs> All right, let's get started. 40 epic best friend tattoos for women, and hang on a second. Hang on. Maybe we should do a quick Google search. <laughs> oh, hey, look at that. Oh, yeah, it's officially the best friend tattoo. Look at that. <laughs> Lesbians kiss at their wedding. Karen. It's so straight. It's so straight. It's really straight. <laughs> Quarantine buddies help lessen the strain of isolate. Hang on a second. Oh my god, they were roommates. <laughs> um. <laughs> I can't say I've ever struck a pose quite like this with just buddies. <laughs> hmm. So who? Ahahaha. Ah, ah, who trying to be friends? Ahahaha. Ah, ah. Mink. I'm sorry, but whenever people do the bink thing, it makes me die because in American Sign Language, putting your fingers together like that means gay sex. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Who trying to be friends? Pink. <laughs> okay, I have a very small ability to use some ASL, and I was teaching Human One some of this the other day, and this one definitely came up. I really, I really like this one. <laughs> Inseparable! Kristen Stewart and close pal Alicia Cargyle step out together in Los Angeles after returning from Hawaii. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. Tabloids awkwardly dance around calling Kristen Stewart a lesbian. <laughs> I have no words for how perfect this is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Kristen Stewart, are you like super gay fam? Thumbs up for me, gal, and your pal. <laughs> Listen, when you get back, let's go on a date. Uh, anyone speak Japanese? I think the word date was mistranslated. I think there's a Japanese word that means going out as friends that got translated as date going out with romantic intentions. <laughs> Do you now? <laughs> oh my goodness. When you and your bestie accept the fact that you'll be single forever. Oh. Well, we might as well get married to each other. Aww. <laughs> oh, last resort. Oh no, neither of us were secretly hoping for this result. Uh, Maybe this is why we intentionally never went on dates with anyone else so we'd be stuck with each other forever. <laughs> oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> in World War II, two gay- Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, we've had this one in previous videos. Hang on a second. Okay, so there's a link. Uh, Historycollection.co. All right, cool. Yeah, all right. So everyone that was asking to be able to, to read those letters, uh, check out that website. Yay! All right, we found it. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. Homer. After years of work, I have finally finished the Iliad. Historians. Great job. We love the friendship between Achilles and Patroclus. Friendship? They were boyfriends. Indeed, two boys who were friends. They were madly in love. Madly in love with a great, madly platonic idea of friendship. <laughs> Ancient Greece has never seen such bullshit before. <laughs> I love the little face of Thomas getting upset. I can't... <laughs> Even just remembering back to the show, I can't remember a time that Thomas was upset. It's so cute. Also, George Carlin, right? The conductor? abso flippin Luli. <laughs> what a good lad. <laughs> Heraldsun.com.au. Oh, oh, okay. 50-50. People are not supposed to be out walking together unless they are from the same household. Seems there are a lot of two middle-aged women households. Bum, 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 ba da 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 Yeah, maybe. Well, maybe, right? Wouldn't that be nice? <laughs> I, I would think that's quite nice. Oh, I hope there are. I hope there's just an immense number of two middle-aged women households. That's so nice. I like that. <laughs> Frozen inspired bra changes color when you bump boobs with a friend. Have you ever dreamed of having a bra that could change colors when you were, when you bumped boobs with a girlfriend? Yeah, we haven't either. <laughs> uh, <laughs> well, I think some people are looking for it. Hmm. 
Hmm. I know I'm being like 13 years old over this, but <laughs> I think it's really cute. <laughs> Sometimes your soulmate was there all along. You just never noticed for a long time. Oh, that's so sweet. Oh, I like that. Oh, I love the last one. Oh, they're so happy. <laughs> yeah, sisters are great. Oh, Oreo salad, no. <laughs> well, I guess you see what you want to see, right? Art is meant to inspire us, and we all see something different in it. So if you see two sisters, cool. They might not be, though. <laughs> I think that's the fun of this subreddit, is there's a lot of, are you sure about that? <laughs> They're not gay. Oh, when lesbians have big boobs? Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes, I guess. <laughs> um... I don't know if that point is as defensible as you think it is, fam. <laughs> Fudge. Aww. Oh, that's so sweet. Oh, okay. Choose people who choose you. Aww. Um, Diana and Alexa, show us what friendship is all about. I think this specific look is probably reserved for a romantic partner. I'm, I'm getting some real romantic partner vibes off of this. <laughs> are you sure they're, are you sure they're showing what friendship is all about? I don't know. Unless you mean friendship within the relationship that is very much romantic, then yep. Yay. <laughs> I'm all for that. <laughs> Five ways Bernie bros can cope with losing. Again. Oh, uh, head, I'm new here. I like your videos. May I ask why you have a French flag behind you? <laughs> That's a very French flag indeed, isn't it? <laughs> just just for comparison's sake, why not? Yeah, not quite. <laughs> Friendships that make your heart smile. <laughs> oh, <t> <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty good friends. You might even say they're best of friends. <laughs> a couple of real gal pals, am I right? <laughs> uh, I need a pretty girl to wear this while I, a Victorian butch lesbian, playfully chases her through our remote mansion in the countryside. The townspeople say we're close companions. Aww. <laughs> I think a lot of dresses look pretty nice. I wouldn't mind wearing a dress. I think I probably mind wearing this dress. I wouldn't want that big cage underneath that holds its shape. And even if it doesn't have that, I wouldn't want just so many frills and whatnot dangling up around my legs. It, it seems too warm. I, mm -mm. Give me a kilt any day. <laughs> Fire Emblem. This MF pair was nice to each other, so they get married. Fire Emblem. This same gender pair are closest to each other, said to be lifelong confidants, the most precious to each other. They live together and are famously buried together. No homo though, 100% platonic. <laughs> ah yes, no homo. Good save on that one. Luckily you thought of that at the last minute. <laughs> oh, I gotta stop doing these. They're killing me a little bit inside. <laughs> I can't believe some people are getting upset about gay marriage in the new Story of Seasons Harvest Moon game. I'd be upset if it wasn't there. It technically isn't. In Japan and other Asian countries, they're best friends. The English version takes away the censorship and just makes them your lover. That's kind of interesting. Are there any other games that cut through mealy mouth subtext like that? I don't know. Most add censorship, not remove it. R slash Harvest Moon claims it's a cultural and ratings issue, that they can't make them explicitly bisexual in Japan, so they make them best friends who have a best friend ceremony and get gifted a kid that they raised together. <laughs> oh my. You may now French your bro. <laughs> oh. oh hey, it's June again. An absolute honor. Okay. Uh, Crusader Kings 3 adds bisexuality, asexuality, and... No, 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 <laughs> oh god, what? Why did they put bisexual stuff in a medieval themed game and somewhat supposed to be historically accurate? Why are they putting sexuality in it at all, no? Lumafow? Do you think it is historically incorrect for people to have sex? <laughs> Gay sex, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ah, yes. The gay sex. A modern invention by modern people. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> it's just, for millennia, no one had the idea to be gay until very recently. <laughs> God. Ah. Ah. <laughs> A best friend key. I see. Hmm. It's one that just, uh, it just fits right in there, hey? <laughs> hmm. I've always wondered about that. Like the half hearts 
that are best friend. I mean, they're super cute. They're super, but are there not some undertones there? And aren't those kind of sweet and deserve highlight as well? I mean, you can be gay for your friend, right? <laughs> That's super sweet. <laughs> Shout out to one topic at a time for the videos. End of this. Hey, hi. <laughs> oh, we're back on the subreddit again. Hello. <laughs> oh, um, me is sad because I'm super stressed because of exams. One topic, uploads video, Sappho and her friend, me, tired happiness noises. <laughs> Bam, I think I remember seeing this comment. Oh, that's so sweet. Oh, well, I'm glad you're liking the videos. And if I can provide any stress relief to anyone who's going through these trying times, whether it be for school papers or just a hard long day after work. And if you're working right now, you're an absolute hero. Um, yay, hooray. Uh, I'm just doing silly videos. I just really enjoy being able to sit down with all of you and talk about things I'm passionate about. And one of those things is just, is highlighting little romantic stories, especially when people are confused about them. <laughs> so yeah, if you like these videos, then I like you too. <laughs> Alright, my beardos and weirdos, I really hope you enjoyed today's video. Oh my goodness gracious, I enjoyed making it. <laughs> so yes, I hope that... Oh hey, Click and I are here. Neat. Oh. Oh, anywho. <laughs> All right, I hope you enjoyed today's video, and yeah, if you like uh, these and you want to see more, obviously comment on the video, but also give some praise over to the kind people that are over in the subreddit. Um, a lot of people are lonely right now and looking for connections, so even if uh, you don't have time to go to the YouTube comments and comment back on every single post, I know some of you do that, and I love you for that, <laughs> um, go to the subreddit and see if you can connect with some people over there. You know, a lot of people are just looking to make friends or just looking to not be alone while they're stuck inside. And I totally feel that. I haven't been outside in a long time. It's just me and Human 1 in here. Hi, Human 1. Hi. Yay. <laughs> she makes me very happy. I feel less lonely. And so I hope that other people out there can also find some connection, whether that be friendship or whether that be <laughs> best friendship. <laughs> All right, my birdos and weirdos. Let me know what you'd like to see done next. Uh, if you haven't joined the supporter Discord yet, hop on Patreon or Twitch, uh, whichever you like, and you can jump on in there and you can talk to me directly. I usually hang out there while I edit and whatnot. <laughs> All right, my birdos and weirdos. We'll see you in the next one, where we take it one topic at a time. I love you all. Roll that outro. Three, two, one. Oh please, 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 oh